Hello guys, and welcome back! We're last left off. We killed Chile! And we should have killed uh, Argentina, but the Portuguese keep running off because they keep getting bombed. And there's nothing I can really do, because I've only got my own fleet of bombers. Which can, I suppose, uh, we'll actually go of attack here. No point in really supporting anything. My bombers will uh, get a bit more experience, I suppose. Pretty, pretty experienced, but... You know, bombers will be very useful later on. So if I also see... We're actually losing men. I don't think we're actually killing anyone. Uh, it doesn't matter. It, all, it always gives experience. And with nine divisions going there, there's no way. Nine hardened veterans of this campaign, they'll finally get there and win. Just, it'll just take a while. A long while. Because there's barely any infrastructure there or there. Oh wait, when did we... Is that a... Did the Indians do a landing in the south? I think they did because they've taken that, which was uh, Argentinian. I'm surprised and amazed. Britain's actually doing something. God, that's gonna take a while. It's gonna, they're taking like a month to just walk. Granted, they have they all have like artillery pieces. In fact, if I just minus that, can you maybe the first reserves can get there a bit faster? I hope. Maybe if I even separate out. No, I won't separate off the world cavalry to make them go there a bit faster. I will, however, start doing this. Let's get the grand battle plan or battle doctrine. All written up, shall we? Anyone particularly good for the job? Anyone that's really standing out? Like six, I'm looking for six skill, everything that uh, needs. Got two with most fins. Uh, I'll stick with you, I think. There's also this, the planes. Which I might turn now towards... Uh, Anti-air. Go for more anti-air. Got plenty of this. More flak power. But yeah, we'll finish up there eventually, and then I can focus on uh, this. I, I, uh, I really do need more men, don't I? Oh wait, we won. We won a battle. They keep sending a few men there to try and stop me because they know it's the last place they can before they lose everything. The first piece of Spanish infantry has been made. Uh, oh, we've actually gotten through all the uh, convoys. We don't even use all of them, which is amazing. It's everything I ever wanted. No! No, my bomber fleet! It was taken! Oh, they killed them! No, <laughs> my bombers! They single-handedly wiped out my entire air force. I don't have anything else. Right, well, let's... Uh, I guess I'll change that, shall I? Tactical bombers. I want like eight of them. Also, I, I want like uh, six normal fighters. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go with that, shall we? I'm just so supremely confident with all the production I've got, I should be able to cover it. They will pay. In blood for the Black and Sky bomber fleet. That was... That's there since the beginning. They fought in World War One. This has been the... You know, this is surprising. I think this is the greatest war. One of the greatest wars in history. Because we've covered about twice the area of Europe. We conquered twice the area of Europe. For God's sakes. As the Iberian Empire. Just comes down and destroys. And we're almost there. We're, in fact, we're there. Cool, right. Oh no, let me guess. This is a key province that they've taken, so I have to go back and take it back. Ah, I have to get around me after all. In fact, though they are cut off, and they won't be able to retake it. Sneaky goddamn Argentinians. We'll, we'll get there eventually. Is there any other place that they've got? No, it's just that one. It's my fault, I should have left someone there. 
Yeah, well, I guess, you know what, you can start making your way back up. We'll have someone to pick you up, I suppose. In fact, if you make your way there, uh, we'll get some troops to pick you up and uh, send you back home. Yeah, uh, infrastructure's gonna be coming around after all the infantry. It's actually nearly at the end of that progression bar. Uh, get all our anti-air, get all our infrastructure, get all our bombers that we want, and then we'll focus more on infantry, I suppose. Still sending men in there? Still? Finally! God, have we done yet? Yes, we're done! Okay. Cool. Bye. It's ours! Look at it! Oh, from the borders of Mexico! To the southern tip of the world! We win! We finally won, and God, we got so much belligerence. Surprisingly, though, not more than Great Britain, who has over a hundred. So as long as we stay in their alliance range, we might be fine. Because no one's declared war in Great Britain yet. Anyway, I think I have to get everyone home now. So... All of these are returning to Europe. I need all the veterans I, I can get, I suppose. So everyone can return to here. Yeah, I suppose. Everyone return there. Alright, the war is over. The war, the war, the Reconquista is done four years. In fact, nearly four years to the day. Uh, we finally won, so. Yeah, end the mobilization. Get the customer goods, consumer goods back. Uh, supplies are fine, reduce that a little bit. Don't need any reinforcements. We'll probably need some upgrades soon, though. We should turn this up. Recruitment campaign. Ireland has broken off its alliance with Great Britain. Well, it's just Britain and me. And our grand empires, I suppose. Yeah, well. I'm happy. We've done it, guys. Spanish Empire is the whole. Almost. I mean, we got Mexico and a... I probably not got to declare war on anyone for a while, since I got that much belligerence. Gonna wait for it to blow over. And, uh, then I'll probably try and scoop up these two and take Brazil, and then I'll look at Mexico and then the islands. I'm not gonna try and fight any of the islands until I get, like, World War II Normandy sort of, uh, D Day tactics, because I can only currently, uh, support, what, free? Free troops? Amphibiously invading somewhere at any one time? So, no, I think I'm going to leave it for now. Oh, yeah, I can finally start forming these up. So, you. I want these going to Africa, actually. Uh, maybe not. I'll keep these in here, I suppose. I'll have a, your free column. There you go. And then I'll have another free column when it comes around. There we go. New infantry, new blood in the army. Got zero man. How have we got zero manpower? <laughs> it's all gone now. It's all gone somewhere. But we got so much more. We got like an entire continent worth of uh, of manpower to call upon now, and resources. Can't forget resources. We're we're self-sufficient, right? Like we're fully self-sufficient by now. We gotta be. I hope. Maybe not an energy. We might be using more energy than we make. It might be. I don't know. It's just an assumption. I'll try and get all the Portuguese troops back as well. I don't need any Portuguese troops defending my colonies. I want them all back in Portugal for whenever war kicks off. Let's get them back home, shall we? Let's bring them all home. And then I'll, send, I'll make troops to send to all the colonies. In fact, I should probably make uh, transport ships. I, well, I'm researching the next version of transport ships, so I'll wait till that's done. It's going to be done years down the line, so I'll stick with the free I've got, I suppose. Well, we're almost there. I guess uh, the third Spanish cookie store has been the first to get there, unless somebody beats them. Well, they, I don't know if they'll be able to even make it all the way back. Uh, that could be problematic. Maybe we'll have to make a stop off over here. In which case, I'll just send them all up. I suppose. 
Uh, let's see. There's, there's nothing to do. I've been... The entire thing that I've been doing now is, uh... Yeah, I should probably, um, have that on low. I don't have the reinforcements to even up, uh, reinforce anyone. But yeah, I've, I've spent so much time fighting that war, I don't know what to do now. Uh, okay, can I send you straight home? No, it's out of range. I guess I have to be here. Send them all the way home. You might as well all walk there. You have to make your way up the limb from breath of, like I said, like two Europe's or one Europe if you go all the way into, like, Russia. Yeah, let's just walk all the way there. Carrying all your equipment, I don't want to see any lost equipment. Because now we've got tanks in Europe. We've got our own tank divisions around here. Got our infrastructure, which we're trying to build up. And in Tierra, can't forget that. We got so much. 200. 200 IC. We're beating out Germany for IC. I don't believe it. Oh, and uh, Britain has annexed Newfoundland. Okay. <laughs> that That's happened. I'll have, like, a super division here. If I have all of you in one big division, uh, I'll need to have someone good replace them. Someone that can command uh, free people instead of... Uh, six people instead of just free. Which this man might be the man for the job. What I'll do is I can do this. War games. Which gives everyone a bit of skill. I don't know if it'll get him any skill. No, but what I can do is uh, I can promote him, so then I can command six. It makes him a worse leader, but that's fine. I don't expect him to really be fighting anything, not on his own. I just want him to, if he does come into it, hopefully he'll be fine. I hope. I can only hope here. No, 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 don't return your, I need you to, right, you're rebased here. This is your new base. Okay, from here, take the conquistadors home to a big parade. Bring them home. Bring them back to Spain. It's been years since the survivors have seen Spain. Tens of hundreds of thousands lost in this war. The bloodiest part's been against Chile and Argentina and Panama. But we're finally making it home. I don't know how much uh, investment I'm going to have in South America, really. I will make a small production base here, but I've already got tons. Nearly 200. And there's all the anti-air coming up. Oh yeah, we got plenty. Plenty of anti-air now. Uh, assembly line, that's 1940. I could get the radar, I suppose. Now I'll do something a bit closer, shall I? I could go for tanks. Or I could go for the mountain tree, because I do want to still make, uh, make mountain cores. Infantry is just for the mountains. So, I should have uh, someone that specialized in that, right? Somewhere. I, I swear I had, uh, like, a mountain... There it is. I want better uh, before I commit to you. Oh, yeah, you're, you're better. You have one more. Cool! 1945 Mountain Divisions. It's coming... Yeah, I, I guess there's nothing else to really do now. Um, I think I'm just fast mode until something breaks out. Uh, I know Italy will try and take over Ethiopia. Or Abyssinia. And uh, Gibraltar's got its anti here. We've really got to bring fans, uh, France back into the fold. They hate me. They hate me, God! They absolutely hate me. <laughs> Probably because of all the belligerence I've just, just acc uh, accumulated right now. Anyway, welcome home. Uh, yeah, you can move like there or something. Barcelona has got its anti air. So it's uh, my capital over here. I'm gonna put you on coastal uh, forts. We'll ha we will have a garrison there, don't worry. It'll be a garrison of hard working Spanish people. That military recovers. Ah, right, so now military is recovered. So, we will be able to uh, do our uh, mobilizations again at any point. Actually, start investing again, can't I? Uh, can I? Uh, let's invest in education, substantial investments. We'll invest in uh, national research. 
Yeah, 4,000. Do I need a recruitment campaign? Do I need that? I don't really want to search for oil. It's a lot of money for something we don't really need at this point. I do feel like we've made a little bit of a mistake, though. Conquering all of South America. Because uh, now we are in the position that Great Britain was. We are completely reliant on outside convoys instead of trade. That could be seen as an issue, because we've, now we've got to also defend our shipping routes from Germany. So maybe I will need to, uh, to make a lot more convoys. Anyway, uh, let's get... Actually, speaking of that, shouldn't I also be going for this? Is there anything... Nothing really close. That could be handy, 1947. I'll go for this first. Yeah, I'll go for this first, tech, uh, task force. Get that there. If only I had this. This is a foreign in my side that the U.S. controls the Panama Canal. We will get it at some point when we go to War of America. Which will happen. I, I swear to God we'll go to War of America. What is this? There's rebels against Paris there. And the fleet is back very soon. Like you're right now. There we go. Okay, all aboard, Portuguese, we'll send you to home. We'll, throw you, we'll just uh, let you go in Lisbon. Anyway, that is the end of this part, so thanks for watching, folks. Hope you enjoyed, and next time, with the Spanish Empire fully established now, uh, we prepare for World War II, which we don't know is coming, by the way. We don't know that that's actually going to be a fin, but... Uh, you know, we, we out of game know it's coming, but in the meantime we can just say we're preparing for a war against France, or something like that. We, that's why we're building this sort of border, this giant border. It was meant for France, but can easily be used for Germany. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Later, guys.